Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome, welcome to our channel. Uh, today we're gonna be teaching you guys how to make ceviche. Uh, we're gonna show you guys step by step what we're gonna do. Yeah. That is a small pot. They're not gonna. Yeah. Okay. Well, we first um we get the cooked ones are already peeled, and all you have to do is put them in the water. Don't let it boil um just until they defrost. Yes, sir. And then what you'll need is a cutting board, some knives, lime. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, about the lime of. Uh... If you ask how many you need or whatever, that all depends how many lime you got. For example... We're going to do for two bags. Yeah. For, so, so, for two bags, we put like around... Ten. No, around fifteen. Okay. Fifteen It depends limes. how sour you want it. Yeah, to. it all depends how sour you want it. And it depends, obviously, how juicy the limes are. Yeah. But, um... So, we get lime, tomatoes... Tomatoes? Cilantro. And it all depends. So, how many tomatoes would you say they so need? So, you, if you would get the small tomatoes... You would need at least around at least ten, ten tomatoes. Yeah, I like a lot of tomatoes. Yeah, and it. if you like, as it all depends how many you. It all depends how many, how, like how much do you like it. And if you get the big ones, maybe for two bags you can, you can do like four. Yeah, that's yeah, so it all depends how much you make. And then cilantro, I just get one thing, um, and onions, and then we also use these two for the. Thing. But normally, um, we also use radish. Radish? What are they called? Rabanos? Radish? And we didn't bring any. And then take the clamato. And we also use um, clamato. Not a little bit. A little, little, bit, give a it a little bit of more it tastes so flavor, good. I guess. And then we all, you're also going to need salt. For sure. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Okay, so what you'll need is obviously... We do it just shrimp. People do it with fish, with um, calamari, a whole bunch of different stuff. But we just use shrimp because that's and how we like it. And some people do it with uncooked shrimp yeah, or fish because gross. they said it tastes better or whatever. But we don't really do it like that because oh, our toddler, she loves it. Yeah. So uncooked is, you know, it's, it may not be good for her. So we do it. So right shrimp, here. lime, cilantro, tomato, onion, clamato. Chips and salt. So that's all the ingredients you basically need to do it. To put in all. Okay, so normally for the tomatoes, I cut the top part out. And then I do little sections like this. Horizontal and then vertical. Oh, jeez, big word. <laughs> this is what it should look like. And then you just cut, cut down. And it'll be tiny little pieces. Just make sure the the knife you're using has a lot of filo. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I, I don't know how to say that. Have a lot of um. Filiori. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, like that cut really good, basically. Yeah, very sharp. There you go. That was uh... it. <laughs> <laughs> you should bring the thing to the hold it. What, baby? Yeah. That's not a spider. It's not. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Why did you guys care, mama? It's okay. Okay, so the tomatoes should look something like that, super small. And then cut all of it and then just put it all in the same thing. Okay, so we already cut all the limes about. You can do it this way. About how many? 15. Yeah. And then we're gonna squeeze them all into a small bowl and bowl. Yeah. And, and we use this. Yeah. So it's not that hard to be able to, to squeeze, squeeze them. So we make sure we have all the juice out. Yeah. Yes. Squeeze that lime. Yes. Yeah. Watch the cilantro. And then you're just gonna cut the top piece in little tiny pieces, like super, super tiny. Get it, chef, ever. Yes, ma'am. Ooh. Get you a man that knows how to make ceviche. <laughs> no. Let's see them hands move. He went to culinary school and um, <laughs> in um, Jackie's kitchen. Yes. So let's see. Get it, get it, get it. Oh, boy. Don't cut your finger. He just cut his finger. Did you cut your finger? No, I didn't. <laughs> Don't try that at home. Ratchet. Mommy, mommy. 
Because I think messy hands have already the cilantro everywhere. And here's our number one fan. What's your name? What's your name, ma'am? Hey! <laughs> so we got the tomato, the shrimp, the cilantro, and the lime. Everything separate. Okay. This is the worst part. I hate doing the onion part because it makes me cry. Show them how you do it. So he does the same like um, thing that I do with the tomato. Cut vertically and then horizontal or horizontal and then vertical, whatever. Get it, get it, get it. Ooh, look at the hand wounds. Do we need that? Just going everywhere. I have to put it in the bowl. Okay. He's gonna put it in the bowl because he makes a mess. But put it on. This is what it should look like. The tomato and we put the onion. Uh uh, you gotta cut I know that's what I'm doing. Tomato and onion, shrimp, lime, cilantro, salt, and tomato. Okay, so we're gonna put the. After he's done cutting this. We're gonna put the. Ooh, yummy. And then put the cilantro. And then the lime. Mix it. Okay, and then the clamato. It's um it, depending on how you yeah. like it. So be tasting it, or not be tasting it because you still need the salt. But um, it depends how you like it. And we like a lot of juice on our ceviche. Okay, so now the salt. Same thing with the salt. You have to be tasting it. Yeah. Make sure Ew. it's not too Ew. salty or too sour. Sure sour. Okay. We don't want high cholesterol. Okay. Let me get a good Let's see the first bite. Nothing. You want some? Want to taste it? More salt. Yummy. You taste it now? Good. Good. Okay. So it's done, and we just put in bowls for us, and then eat it with chips. Yeah, pretty close. So Bye. this is what it should look like. This is um, cumin. I usually use it to um, add flavor. More yeah, flavor. add flavor. And it tastes really good, to be and honest. And also with chili. Chili, if you want some. And this is yours. So, yeah, guys. Uh, this is a certain way how to make this ceviche. Uh, I hope you guys have a blessed weekend. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you hit that bell button. Yes. And uh, stay tuned for more videos. Bye. Say bye, Nati. Say bye. Ugly. Say bye. <laughs>